Hey y'all, good morning. It's Bonita Aura again. Please, if you've not yet subscribed, please subscribe down below. Uh, guys, today is the 15th of January 2020. Yeah, today well, we still don't have internet. I woke up thinking maybe the elections were done and we're going to be with internet, <laughs> but I was wrong. I mean, I was wrong. Today is Today they are counting the votes, they are turning the votes. So it's the counting day. So we don't know what is going to happen, but we still don't have internet. What I'm going to do today, I'm just going to watch movies, shoot some, some videos. Thank you along with me throughout my day and uh, watch movies, read novels. Like I get what to do to make myself busy. I'm sorry about that background. As I wake up, I want to raise my faith. There is some channel I watch on TV. It's called Faith. Uh, I want to raise my faith, do some prayings, do some, you know, raising my spirit to spiritually. So I'm going to show you what I've been watching. After I've been watching Faith, then switch to cartoons. I'm a person of animations and cartoons. Really, I'm just like a little, little kid. Let me take you to what I've been doing this morning. Please, please subscribe. Let me show you what I've been watching and yeah. Well, me. What I've been watching, I just love, love, love that TV station. It raises my faith a lot. Then I love watching these. I love... watching i love watching sometimes i i check on disney junior if i'm sad if i want to cheer up my day if i want to i mean get over the mood things in case i have the mood things i watch these cartoons all the animations but i usually go to nickelodeon it's what i watch yeah, Spongebob. <laughs> Who really doesn't like Spongebob? At first, I used not to like this type of cartoon. Spongebob, I mean, used to make me feel so, so bad. Yeah. The network is so bad. It's raining outside. Let me show you how it's raining. It's raining outside, it's raining so so heavily. It's raining so heavily. Yeah. That's how it looks. I love flowers, by the way. I love I'm a very very big fan of flowers. So those are the flowers I have on my shade. What's on our TV stations were? So guys, let me show you what's uh, on our TV stations right now. This is the 15th and uh, it's a tally day when they're counting the votes or when they're tallying the votes. The network is really, really bad because of the weather. I, see, I think you see the signal is not clear. The key statistics, you can't do general elections. Number of districts... 146 districts have been considered for this election. You have number of constituencies. Yeah, is that our president? And 53 constituencies. That, um, and the number of sub-counties in uh, our entire country. We are voting. There are seven of them. It's one uh, lady. Actually, one seven. The eleven. And the number of parishes is 10,594 parishes in consideration. We have one lady. Then... Yeah. The polling stations, we have 34,684 polling stations. Let me stations. check on another now, station. Now, we get to look at the increasing population every single election. We do have an increment in population. If
314 votes, then the Forum for Democratic Change candidate, Patrick Amuriat, he got uh, the 17 votes, then the National Unity Platform or candidate, uh, Robert Sentam, uh, Robert Sentam, uh, he got zero uh, seven votes and the other candidates uh, had no votes and um, our grand listeners should know that uh, or, uh, or apart from president um seven or the nrm candidate he was the only one who had um agents at the different polling stations in Kavale district uh, thank you so much for getting there. An update from Kavale. Let's now go back to Fort Porter. This time with Scovia Terry giving us an Guys, update. that one is called Flavia. I just love her. She has also a channel, a YouTube channel. You can check it. You can check her out. She has really, really nice content. She's called Flavia Tumsini. She's a TV presenter and a radio presenter. She's really, really good. So guys, as you're seeing, the, those are the that's what is taking place right now today telling the votes guys telling the votes counting the votes we don't know when when this is ending really guys we need our internet back we're so bored we need to upload videos we need to talk to our friends we need to i mean see what's going on in our country more yeah that's what is going on all the tv stations as you've seen so guys here we are i'm going to take coffee mat i just like it the smell is just so so good um yeah I don't like anything in it, whether tea leaves, whether tea spices, whether sugar. I just like taking it so plain. Plain. Yeah, it's very affordable. Uh, it's um, 14800 You can go buy it and check it out. It's very, very nice. My ninjas are looking at me. Yeah, good morning. I'm sorry, yesterday I didn't get time to get back to the camera to notify you how my I spent my day. But today is the third day without internet, guys. It's the 16th of Jan, 2020. Internet at all. So I don't know how today I'm going to spend my day again. Yesterday I didn't get back to you because I really felt so bored getting the camera and recording some things, you know. So let me see today if I get new things, I will get back to you. I'll be notifying you on how I'll spend my day. But today is a day three without any internet usage. So I now have videos to upload. I have things to do via my phone, via my email. But I have nothing to do. Yesterday I slept so, so, so very late. I slept three, three. 3 a.m. Yeah, 3. Is it 3 a.m.? <laughs> yeah, 3 a.m. I was watching some Nigerian movies. I just felt like my brains are stuck on watching. I couldn't do anything else. I couldn't sleep. I could, because my, my body was... I was feeling a lot of fatigue. I didn't do jogging yesterday. I haven't done jogging today. I slept late. So I've woken up very, very late. To, right now, it's... um. 10 i'm going to make some breakfast and see what will be next i've been out here getting some fresh air this early morning um getting some fresh air and i'm getting back inside to make some breakfast and eat and see how i'll spend my day guys i'll get back to you later bye bye
Hey guys, I'm just back again. Guess what? Right now it's 30. Sorry, right now it's 3 p.m., 3.30 something. And the president, the incumbent, I mean, has been elected as the president. That's President Yoli Kagutam Seveni. Again, I don't know. I'm excited. I think you just see my expression on the face. Yeah, so I don't know now what is going to be next with our country. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I'm just hanging on just right there. So let's just wait and see whether we're going to get the internet back since they've just announced the president of Uganda again. And we're just waiting to see. But the assumptions that we may get our internet back on Monday, but we are not sure. Let's just wait and see. So let me give you some little glimpse or let me just give you a short video that I've recorded from the TV so that you can see how they have, they have announced our president in their different capacities and how many votes each one got. There are 11 candidates that, that were there. So just get to the video. 536 voting votes by the same candidate, which is represents a percentage of 3.24 of the total valid votes cast. Kabriya Chakiza Joseph, 44,300, which is represents 0.44 percent. Kaleme Nasilinda, 37,400. Seriously, thirty five thousand nine hundred and eighty three, representing zero point three six per cent. Kyagorani sent him Robert three million four hundred and seventy five two hundred and ninety eight, three million four hundred and seventy five thousand two hundred and ninety eight, representing thirty four point eight three per cent. Mao Robert, 55,665, representing 0.56 percent. Mayamba Wile, 14,657, presenting 0.15 percent. Mugisha Muntu Greg, 65,334, representing 0.65 percent. Moise Jeffrey, 24,673, representing 0.25%. Tumukunde Henry Kakurugu, 50,141, representing 0.50%. Your wedding seven to Mahabura Kaguta, 5,851,000. 037 sure. representing 58.64% representing 58.64% total number of invalid votes 381,386 amounting to 3.68% of the total number of votes cast the total number of votes cast 10,359,479 amounting to 57.22% of the total number of registered voters. Now therefore, candidate Yoweri Museven to Haguba Kabuta, having obtained the highest number of votes in the election and the votes cast in his favor, being more than 50% of the valid votes cast at the election, the Electoral Commission declares Yoweri Museveni Tibuhabuwa Kaputa elected President of the Republic of Uganda at the presidential election held on the 14th day of January 2021, dated this 16th day of January 2021. Hey all, good morning. Today is the fourth day. Yeah, it has been a series from second. The first video is just separate, then this one's from second to the fourth. Today is the fourth day. Without internet, the president was announced, the elections were done. Now we really don't know when we are going to get our internet back. 
because right now there are no signs that we are going to get the internet back. I don't really know. No one knows really. Just right now, I'm going to Ginger to meet some people. I have also a relative. Uh, we are taking him back to school. He's in boarding school. He's in Form 4. That's Senior 4. We are taking him back to school and then I'll come back to, to, to my place and see what's next to do. Yeah, because I have some work I have to do from my work for my workplace I have to do so I'll take you through my day if possible if I get time to record yeah let's meet a bit let's meet later yeah guys right now I've ended my videos I mean this is the end of the shutdown series Please like and subscribe to my channel if you've not yet subscribed. And thanks for watching again. <laughs> Meet again next time.